plants out here today. We're using Super Thrive. This stuff smells awful. Very awful. It's a fish emulsion. So we're going to get a little crazy. Let's get to work. I've used this last year. My peppers looked phenomenal last year. Here's just the plants. These peppers were planted February 14th, around the 14th. Um, they're looking really good. Our peas, which were planted about three weeks ago, they've been sitting in this greenhouse during the day. I haven't had a good way to keep this warm at nighttime, which has been a bit of a bummer. The Using the aquarium heater with a big tub of water hasn't really worked. Um, it's kept the temperature about four degrees overnight uh, warmer than what it is outside, so it's just not working. All right, so we're gonna make sure we shake this right good. Open it up, and this stuff smells awful. That's why you saw me put on a respirator. It's the worst smelling fertilizer I've ever had. Can you smell it? Can you see inside there? Probably not. It's just brown mush, but based on the instructions, we need uh, to dilute four tablespoons into a gallon of water and then feed every two to four weeks. We're going to go a little bit weaker than that. Um, we're probably going to do about two. So we're going to use the bottom watering method. We're going to dump that out. It smells awful. Looks awful. This is two gallons of water. Oh, we're going to dump this in and we'll see what happens. It almost looks like sewage. Okay. Now we're just going to take our plants and drop them in this ugly brown fertilizer water that is literally going to make these things take off. Ah, it smells awful even outside. Can't wait till I bring these back inside overnight and smell how bad they are. So now we'll just wait, we'll continue this process of bottom watering until we get through all the plants. It's been about five minutes or so. I can see the tops here starting to soak all the way through. So I'm gonna start pulling these out and we'll get another set in here. And just to mention once again, the reason why the bottom watering method works so well is that it forces the roots to go deeper rather than going up towards the surface to get water and nutrients. Put a link in the description below for the Super Thrive fertilizer that I'm using. And if you want to see more about the bottom watering method, you can watch that video here. Or if you want a refresher on how to pop your plants out of the six pack trays for transplanting, you can watch this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one.